Thank you, Mr. Williams, for letting Reach a Student interview you today. I would like to ask you a few questions. Can you tell me about yourself and which grade you teach here at Nord Anglia International School? So, like you said, uh, my name is Mr. Williams and I teach Year 5 at Nord, Nord Anglia International in Hong Kong. What are the ages of students typically in Year 5? Uh, typically 9 and 10 years old. How many students are in your class? Uh, at the moment I have 21 children. Uh, the maximum in the class is always 22. Do you rotate students for subjects or do you teach your class exclusively? Um, so I teach my, uh, the children in my class for English, for maths, uh, for science, for PSHCE and for theme and then they go to specialist teachers for their specialist subjects such as drama or music. What subjects are covered in year five? Okay, so there's the ones I mentioned before. They're the core subjects, maths, English and science. And then I also teach PSHCE, uh, which is Personal, Social, Health, Citizenship, Education. <laughs> and um, theme I teach as well. And then they go to specialist teachers for art, uh, music, drama, and PE. At our school, fifth graders are required to use their own laptops. Do you have these similar requirements? Uh, so in our school, we, each child has an iPad. Uh, which we keep in class. Um, in our class we keep them named so they have their own specific iPad and that's what we use a lot in our learning. What qualities do you think make Nord Anglia International School unique? Um, okay, so well, thinking about uh, this school, uh, one of the first things is like I said the technology. We have a lot of technology here which is very exciting. It's exciting for the teachers because they get to learn how to use it to help the children and it's very motivating for the children as well uh, to use them. And we do a lot more collaboration through, through, the, through the iPads using the interactive whiteboard. And are there any unique challenges or benefits teaching in Hong Kong versus where you may have taught before? So before I was in Hong Kong, I taught in Oxford in England, uh, in a primary school there. Um, when I think about the differences, the challenges, um, the, the children I have in my class now come from all over the world. So we have many children who don't have English as their first language. And so for me that's a good challenge because I have to think more, even more creatively about how I can engage these students, not just through the English language. I've interviewed teachers at my school in Windermere, Florida, but I think it will give our students an entirely different perspective hearing from another Nord Anglia school teacher located halfway across the world from us. So I thank you again for taking the time to let Reach a Student interview you. A pleasure. So I really like interviewing peers, as Reach a Student is all about gaining insight from students like you, especially when we are all part of the same group of Nord Anglia schools. So can you tell us about yourself, starting with your name and age, and what grade you're in? My name is Ava, I'm 10 years old, and I'm in year 5. So can you describe a typical school day for you? Uh, typical school day, I would wake up at 6.30 in the morning. I would take the school bus and arrive at around 7.30. Then we would do morning work such as reading or read or iPad. Um, and then we would have an assembly. Um, we would do English, Max, um, break, and so on. Then we would end school at 2.45 p.m. and we would, I would take the school bus back home. I would usually start doing some homework. Then if I have an extracurricular activity, I would do it in the evening. So what subjects do you do in year five? Um, during Inside class, we do English, theme, science, literacy, and outside of class, we do maths, art, music, PE, art, drama, um, 
and sometimes we go in the science lab. What was your favorite school assignment this year? Um, in homework assignment, I liked doing the story bird and I like doing word reports. What is the story bird assignment? Oh, the story bird assignment was to create a picture book um, using repetition or just a regular fairy tale or fairy tale story. How do you like it here at North Anglia International School? I like going to the school. Um, I've been in lots of schools over the, around the world. I've been in school in America, Australia, and England. Wow. How much time do you s typically spend doing homework each day? Um, on a regular day, I would do homework for 45 to an hour, 45 minutes to an hour. Do you play a musical instrument? Yes, I play the piano. What sports do you play? Um, I play tennis. Um, I'm on a swim team, and I used to do rugby. Wow. And do you have any other hobbies? Um, I like to just swim around with my friends in the sea. I like to draw. And sometimes when I'm bored, I like to read. And how do you spend your weekends? Do you find yourself doing homework during this time? Um, usually, I'm not doing homework. Um, because we have a week to do it, which I think is nice because you get the weekend to play with your friends or do extracurricular activities. And do you have any siblings? Yes, I have two brothers. One goes to the school and he is eight years old. And thank you, Ava. My younger brother is going to fifth grade next year, so I'm glad I'm interviewing a year five student for the younger students at our school. I also hope that you can visit us in Orlando and I'd be glad to give you a tour of our North Anglia school campus.